What's going on 22 Comics and today I've got a mini little eBay haul that I've got this past week that also made me think of something that I never really thought of before. So let's start off with this little mini haul, check out what I got. You know, as we all know, I'm a big Iron Man fan. I found this Tales to Astonish Marvel Masterworks The Invincible Iron Man um, Volume 1. This has... Tales of Suspense 39 all the way to 50 on it. I think I picked it up for like 15 bucks. That was shipping and everything. $16, something like that. The book by itself, the barcode indicates it would be like a $50 book normally. So I thought that was an amazing deal and really happy to have this in the collection. So let me put this over here. That way y'all can see it better. All right, next book up. This is a super exciting book. And this is really like what's got me thinking about this new mindset that I have towards eBay really because that's how I do most of my finding and most of my hunting because I don't really have LCS is where I'm at so let's get this thing open if you follow me on Instagram you've seen this book already I posted it last Friday when I got it but for those of you who have not seen it on my Instagram I picked up a Thor number one Midtown Comics variant at a 9.6. Sweet, awesome looking book. Very excited to have this in the collection. Um, let's put this over here so y'all can see it better. I got this book for around $60. And this book is like, the Thor one's starting to heat up. I understand there's a variant, and I understand that there's, you know, variants can bring different prices. However, for somebody that's looking for the first appearance of somebody, or a, a first event, or in this case, a character turning to another character, eBay deals are still out there to be had. Tip number one is to look for the high-end books. Even though these books may be completely priced out of your range, it does not hurt to look. You never know what you're going to find. So I really do encourage you to go and look for those high-end books that you want. Um, this is the second one that I've had, you know, the luck of being able to find. The first one being not long ago, last month I believe, I found a second printing of Ultimate Fallout 4 for really, really, really super good price. It's actually at CGC right now getting graded. I just kind of want to encourage people like to sit there and actually still look for the books, even though they're out of your reach. You never know what you're going to find on eBay. You never know what somebody's going to misspell and, and it turn up in a search. Or they're just not going to put enough information in it, and so people just kind of fly by it. Or things of that nature like there's so many deals to be had and you just have to have the patience to be able to find them tip number two is to look for slabbed books you're gonna find awesome deals sometimes here and there on books that are already slabbed at whatever grade I've been picking up nine O's and nine six just anything nine and up depending on what the book is as long as the deal is really good if it's if that's what i would have invested in the book and getting it slabbed why not go ahead and buy it i think you have to weigh all your options when looking at these things you have to take into consideration the price of shipping the price of having it graded the price of the book itself and then the risk factor of it going of sending it in this thor number one for like i said i think shipping taxes everything out the door was like 60 bucks and that slab at a 9.6 like I know that's a 9.6 that's an amazing deal like I would wind up spending that much just for the book and to send it off to have it slabbed and still may not get a 9.6 out of it if you enjoyed this video and you got value out of it please hit that like hit that subscribe button I greatly appreciate it I'm also gonna have some other videos that I've done over here you can find me on Instagram at 22 underscore comics. You can also find me on a podcast called Comically Comics. Thank you for checking out my video, and y'all have a good one.